His name is symbolic for Ukrainians, in the first years after its appearance, Renault symbol confidently entered the top 10 most purchased foreign cars in our market. Of course, it is not without flaws and does not shine with reliability, but in operation the symbol will not ruin the second owner. The second generation Renault Clio appeared in 1998, and a year later compact sedans, called the Clio symbol, joined the traditional hatchbacks, they began to be produced in Turkey. The car was also assembled at the Russian of Tofremos for about a year and a half, but they were not delivered to us. Since February 2002, the car began to be produced at the Turkish Oyuk Renault plant. Since then, it has been called simply Renault Symbol. The small car was sold in Ukraine only with 1.4-liter petrol engines, 75 and 98 horsepower. The standard transmission is a 5-speed manual gearbox. Automatic 4-band was offered as an option for both motors. At first, Symbol had only a manual gearbox, and since 2005 the number of modifications has increased due to the appearance of an automatic transmission in the technical arsenal. In some European countries, the compact Renault was also sold with a 1.5-liter turbo diesel, 65 horsepower. True, in our market there are no such versions. If externally the machine looks pretty neat, then inside it does not make such a favorable impression. However, this applies mainly to finishing materials, which in cars of this class and price category are not of high quality. There are flaws in the overall well-designed ergonomics, the seat cushions are short, the steering column is adjustable only in height, and the pedal assembly is cramped. In addition, squeaks appear in the cabin over time, and traces of contact with solid objects remain on the plastic. In the basic symbol package, there is not even a tachometer, but there is only an airbag for the driver, an immobilizer and power steering. But the top version provides for a 16-valve engine, 98 horsepower, front power windows, air conditioning, radio, fog lights, power mirrors and alloy wheels. I had to pay extra for the machine. In addition to the information received from the mechanics of specialized Renault centers, I read dozens of reviews about the symbol. Most of all I was surprised that a huge number of people received positive impressions from its operation. Moreover, among the authors there were many owners of old copies, which dashed off more than 200,000 kilometers on Ukrainian roads. A brief summary about this small car is something like this, a strong and unbreakable bug with a comfortable suspension and reliable units. Indeed, gasoline engines are quite reliable subject to certain recommendations. Every 30,000 to 40,000 kilometers of run, the injection nozzles should be flushed. Candles and ignition coils from moisture, as a rule, fail. So it is better to wash the engine in a specialized service or carefully protect attachments from water. In motors, oil often leaks from under the crankcase gasket and the front crankshaft oil seal. Engines also love branded service. For example, replacing a timing belt in Uncle Vasya's garage can end very badly for the car, since there are no marks on the crankshaft and camshaft, and the numbering of the cylinders is counted from the flywheel. The timing belt along with the rollers must be changed after 60,000 kilometers, while it is desirable to revise the water pump. If it starts to leak, it is better to change it immediately, otherwise you will have to do it after 5,000 to 10,000 kilometers, repaying for expensive work. The drive belt is supposed to be updated after 80,000 kilometers. At risk are also a generator, starter, various electronic sensors and blocks. For example, again, after washing, the sensor for switching the modes of the machine may fail. On a manual transmission, the gearshift lever becomes loose over time. There are cases of local breakdowns of gearboxes after 150,000 km due to wear of synchronizers and gears. Before this period, an average of 120,000 km, the clutch kit may not survive a little. After 150,000 km, there is a high probability of breakdowns in the automatic transmission due to natural wear and tear. This is a hydraulic valve block, a torque converter and a clutch package. You should not expect a catch from the suspension. Usually the first to be asked for eternal rest are the struts and stabilizer bushings. After 100,000 km, ball bearings and hub bearings fail. In steering, often, after 30,000 to 50,000 km, you have to change the tie rods with tips. Brake pads are enough for an average of 30,000 km. However, their life expectancy depends on the driving style. In the rear suspension, closer to the 100, shock absorbers will make themselves felt, and it will only be necessary to completely shake up the suspension with the replacement of all rubber bands and silent blocks closer to 180,000 to 200,000 km. On a used Renault symbol, install mud guards if they are not there, because the sedan left the assembly line without these parts, otherwise the paint will quickly fly off the thresholds and wheel arches. But at symbol, thresholds and other cavities are filled with wax, 
which prevents internal corrosion, and plastic wings hold a slight blow and do not rot. Both engines with a volume of 1.4 liters, 75 and 98 horsepower, are demanding on fuel quality, but they work great on 92 octane gasoline, especially the 8 valve unit. When buying a used symbol, change the timing belt and drive belt, they serve 60,000 and 80,000 kilometers, respectively. Breaking any of them is fraught with serious expenses. On the 16 valve version of the engine, the consequences will be most serious, both manual and automatic transmissions acquire many shortcomings with age, therefore, when buying a car, the diagnosis of these nodes is very relevant. The clutch lives at least 120,000 km. Front suspension with McPherson struts is easy to use. Stabilizer struts and bushings take care of an average of 50,000 km. Shock absorbers will have to be changed at 80,000 to 100,000 km. Ball joints last about the same. The rear suspension, in the design of which is a semi-independent torsion beam, does not know serious costs up to 180,000 km. It is at this stage that the time will come to replace all the rubber bands and silent blocks. Before its onset, you will have to update the shock absorbers a couple of times and the stabilizer struts and bushings three or four times. 